Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a heavy meal prep for the upcoming week. With the festivities all around the corner, I do not want to miss on the healthy side of food preparation. Of course there will be sweets, snacks and loads of other goodies. with the festivities but the nutrition and health should not take back seat vinegar and a dish soap solution is one of the perfect way to clean the inside of refrigerator or on the contrary anywhere in the kitchen because it is kind of non toxic and it cleans and disinfects the surfaces absolutely perfect you don't need any harsh chemicals i like to clean my refrigerator every once in a week i also soak all my vegetable containers where i do my meal prep in vinegar water it completely disinfects and prepares them for the meal prep Usually we consider meal prep as cooked food but essentially with all the vegetables and fruits there is lot of cleaning and pruning that is needed Lot of vegetables and fruits perish faster than the others I recently got this box of garlic and honestly I wasn't happy with it. So in my opinion I would always prefer a fresh garlic. So this experiment was absolutely a big fail. But the way I store garlic is foolproof. Just put a tissue paper inside the container and then add all the peeled garlic. It will stay fresh for 7 to 10 days I use these bowls to segregate all my produce and soak them in vinegar water Once they are washed I leave them to dry for half an hour or so meanwhile I dry all my containers I recently purchased these uh, silicone Ziploc bags. They are reusable and very much environment friendly. I like to chop carrots and beans in different sizes and whenever I need it, I can use it. This is one of the staples that's there in my fridge and freezer all the time. Mumbai still is heavily drenched in the rains and having a sweet corn for evening snacks sounds absolutely perfect just soak the broccoli in the same water and it will be steamed in 5 minutes or so do not switch on the gas i'm doing only one cooking that is preparing the onion tomato paste that we use in almost everything I do not add any masala. I do not add ginger garlic paste. I just make it with onion, tomatoes, salt and turmeric. I just feel when you add the fresh spices the taste of the sabzi or the gravy becomes far more potent than when you try and store it. So now let's pack all the produce. Appalachian sunrise meets my skin. Even with my eyes still closed, I feel it coming in. Golden, I'll follow them. Golden, golden, golden. Everyone's fridge is different when it comes to the sizes. 
but the systems remains the same. Try and use as many transparent containers as possible. Reason being you'll be able to see things more conveniently. All the healthy snacks, vegetables and fruits that can be eaten raw should be kept at eye level for any family member to approach it first. Things that are more perishable should be kept on the topmost layer instead of pushing it behind. And also keep a chart all the time handy that what is inside your fridge. These small things will really help you to avoid any kind of food wastage. I do not like peeling pomegranate. Hence, I peel the pomegranate completely for the entire week. Now, many will argue that if you chop the vegetables, there is a lot of nutrition that is lost. You are right. All the water-soluble vitamins do get lost the moment we wash them. So, even while we are washing the vegetables or fruits, we are losing quite a lot of vitamins. And these vitamins are vitamin C, A and E. And there are many other ways that you can consume or increase the quantity of vitamin C, E and A in your food. Any fat soluble nutrient or micronutrients will not be destroyed if you are doing a meal prep. Now few things we have to keep in mind is heat, oxygen are the enemies of any kind of food including moisture. So if you are able to avoid these three evils then there is no harm in doing a meal prep. I have started eating more greens than ever because there is always some sort of salad or meals prepped in my fridge and it does not take me more than 15 to 20 minutes to cook the lunch or dinner. The food is loaded with vegetables just the way any nutritionist would suggest you that your half of your plate should be full with green vegetables. Once the vegetables are prepped, whether you have a help for cooking or not, it makes it really easy to whip up something quick and fast and it just avoids the last minute takeaway orders.
these lettuce leaves are best stored with loads of tissue paper and also adding a layer of tissue paper on top along with the cling film. This makes my life so easy and so convenient. I am able to eat salad at least one meal a day. These cling wrap are absolutely biodegradable and I will leave a link for all the products that I have used in the video in the description box for you. For amaranth, just weed out all the roots and different weeds from it and just keep it in a layer of tissue paper covered from all side. This needs to be washed only before the cooking. Same goes for the spinach. I store all my meal prepped vegetables in my refrigerator drawer inside these containers. I have nine of these and they almost get empty by end of the week. And in the bottom drawer I keep quick easy grab and go vegetables like zucchini, capsicum, cucumbers. I like to freeze few of the bananas and these are the produce like beans and carrots inside my freezer. Now let's whip up a dinner under 20 minutes which is as good as any good restaurant. Let me show you how. The recipe is left in the description box for you. So do enjoy. In this container, I have segregated different cuts of beans and carrots which I'll be using in next two days only. When it comes to cooking fast, I have shared this in my pantry video which I will leave a link in the i above and in the description box. I made this onion pickle during the 15th August time if you have watched that video and it's still going perfect. 
Let's could reach everyone there being wars. Vegetable rice, paneer shimla mirch, raita, cucumber salad with pickled vegetables, and some whole spices, ghee ka tadka. The dinner is ready. Let's enjoy it. Wish that I could stay in this moment forever so I can hold you in my arms. Carry you on my shoulders as long as I'm able. Scare the monsters under your bed. Deep in the biting, liking for you is all I need. Until my heart gives in. got some inspiration and idea from this video if you did then don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video and do leave me a comment if you enjoyed any part of the video your comments make my day so beautiful and thank you again for watching my video and next time see you bye bye to catch you if you fall deep and Till my